Hi guys, it's Mino. We just did something really amazing on a 24 by 24 and I want to do it again on a 12 by 12. So I have a five ounce cup. I will go over my colors for you at the end, but I really want to pour this. Okay, so we're going to start with a little tiny bit of gold, literally just like the smallest drop. Barely even spreading out on the bottom of the cup. I'm going to come in with quinacridone violet and some Payne's gray. Then some metallic purple. Some more of the quinacridone violet. Then a little bit of gold. Some permanent deep violet. A little bit of phthalo blue. Some more Payne's gray. A little bit of metallic white pearl. More of the quinacridone violet. And a little bit of gold on top. Okay, so I'm not actually filling it all the way up to the five ounce mark. This is probably about three and a half, four ounces right there. And I'll show you why. So I'm going to pour a small puddle of the gold first. Oh, hello, wind. <laughs> Hi, Gail. Let me do this one and then you can play, okay? Okay. Wow. <laughs> She's blowing like crazy. Okay. We're going to do a ring pour. Okay, here we go. We're going to do a ring pour. little tiny bit of gold and I just stuck my finger in there but that's okay because we're gonna wreck it anyhow okay so now I'm gonna go around this with my pearl the same consistency as what's on the in the pour going to use some thinned out Payne's Gray. This is much thinner than all of that and I'm actually going to thin it out a tiny bit more right now. There's a lot in here. All right. <laughs> okay, I'm going to pour this around the edge. So this one is our flow extender. So let's spread that out. Okay, now we're going to use our comb and I'm going to wreck it. I'm going to use the smaller side because this is a 12 by 12 into the white. So from the center in here out that way. So that it drags it through the white area. Do that again. Okay, we're almost done. There you go. Okay, so now that's really cool. So leaving that ring of white around there actually allowed some contrast for those that blue to become visible. So we're going to tilt this minimally. 
because I really want to keep this composition. Cool on the sun. Oh, awesome. Okay, I'm gonna get that little side off too. Okay, now we're gonna come back down to the center and go off that bottom edge. edge now. It's nice and easy. Come back down to the center again. And go off that bottom. center. Stretch this edge out. Okay, while the paint is about here, I'm going to take this, a little bit of this off too. So that it stretches. <laughs> That's awesome. Actually, I kind of want to take some of, open this up a little bit. Let's see, where's the way to wear paint? A little bit of that off. Take it back down. And there we go. I love it. Okay, so that's it for this one. I'll show you when it's dry. Oh, I gotta tell you my colors real quick, sorry. Okay, now that I've gotten that on my system. Okay. Golden's Permanent Deep Violet. Liquitex Basic Stalo Blue. Golden's Payne's Gray. Decoart Americana Decor Metallics, 24 karat gold. Artist's Loft Metallic Purple. Golden's Quinacridone Violet. And this last one was a combination of Artist's Loft Metallic White and Decoart Americana Decor Metallics in Pearl. So, that's very cool. Okay. So that's everything. I'll show you when it's dry. Okay, so this is a few days later. And I'm sure you guys have figured out that this was the little leftover paint one from Wildstar. But this one's actually very different. <laughs> There's a lot more purple. And we have a lot more of the white pearl on this one. But the gold on here is just amazing. The Payne's Gray with that quinacridone violet and then uh, the little, little sharp combs of the gold. It's really pretty. Really, really cool. I like this one a lot. <laughs> Beautiful depth. Beautiful color. I haven't varnished this one or anything. I should. Probably will. Actually, I might try resining this one it's very cool <laughs> so 
This was the little mini wild heart or wild star. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching guys and hanging out with me. I will see you for the next one. Have a great day.